Hey everybody, uh, this is a video about, um, what's it called, me showing off my fossils, um, and I already made a video about, um, I just talking about my snake, so, uh, I'm just gonna, so why not just make a video about talking about my fossil, then, if you notice that I'm talking a bit loud, it's because there's like an air conditioner on that next to my house, so, yeah, so, I'm just gonna, just, first off, I'm gonna start with a Spinosaurus tooth, uh, it, I got it, I got it for my ninth birthday. Spinosaurus tooth. I don't really know what to say about it, but other than you know, it looks cool. Uh, there, there's some facts about it right there. I'm not gonna read that because you know whatever. And then here's an illustration of it. Um, it looks actually real good, gotta say. And then here is another Spinosaurus tooth. Another Spinosaurus tooth. And this is actually a Brachiosaurus tooth. Another Brachiosaurus tooth and another Brachiosaurus tooth. And actually, Brachiosaurus is like a Apatosaurus, Brachiosaurus, and Brontosaurus is. Uh, um, a I mean, sorry. Apatosaurus and Brachiosaurus, they're, they're, not, they're, they're not different things. Apatosaurus are actually the real name for them. Uh, so, yeah. Alright, here is a fossil I got at a place called Muscle Rock. It's you know, I have a bunch of clam fossils, cause, it, cause the, cause the place, cause Muscle Rock used to be fully, uh, underwater, so, I mean, I went, so there's just gonna be a, a bunch of clam fossils there, cause, you know, clams will underwater, um, and, uh, my, my friend, um, whenever I show, show this to him, um, he always asks, uh, what's it called? Um, are you gonna open them up to see if they're open? There's no reason to open. Uh, these are like two million, two million years old or something. So there's a almost a hundred, one hundred percent chance that there's going to be no clam in there. So this I found out Muscle Rock. It's the biggest one. And actually, over here, I'm running over here right now. This uh, is something I'm working on right now. Um, okay, just a bit of, a bit more of rocks on it, so I'm working on it to get all, get, get all those off, but, uh, I'm running all the way back. Um, okay, this is also I found that with a rock, once again this, and once again I found this. Actually, the thing that's unique about this one, is that, see, it, this, like, this, for example, this one. It doesn't have, like, lines, like, or, it's not, you know, kind of like this, it's, it's not that texture, it's, this one is too more smooth, well, this one is, you know, kind of, not jagged, I can't really explain it, but, yeah, and this, oh, that's, that's my dad's favorite, I don't, I don't know why, it's, like, the most preserved, maybe, oh, sorry, uh, I think I get you a very good shot. The, yeah, this is my dad's favorite one. So, yeah. Alright, uh, okay. Time for this one. This is a deer jaw. I found out, we found out Lake Berryessa. Then this. It's not actual, actual real gold. It's a, just a, it's, it's a kind of rock called fool's gold. It's not actually real gold. Because, and actually during the... During during the gold gold rush, uh, miners used to think that this was actually actual real gold, but 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 they were able to tell it by um, rubbing it. Um, if it if it smelled, then it was fool's gold. If it didn't smell, then it was uh, what's it called? It was, if it didn't smell, it was real gold. But then unfortunately, this isn't real gold. This is just uh, normal. It's just fool's gold. And this. Well, this is, a, is actually turtle poop. Um, again, I've got it for my ninth birthday. And yeah, over here is one of the ones with the most. This is like a little fish painting thing. I, I, I'm not sure what it is, really. Uh, this right here is a, is a great white tooth. This is a mosasaurus tooth. This, uh, what's it called, is a tiger shark tooth. This. I gotta say, I forgot. Kind of looks like a Brachiosaurus tooth, but it's not. This, uh, sorry, is a great white shark tooth. 
this is a show of an an of uh, I forgot the name of it. It's it's just in the back of my mind. And actually, if you flip it over, it's all it's like smooth. Not sure why. Also, that also it's also like with that with the great white stripe too. It's just smooth on the this part. Not sure why that is, but and these two, well, they're one of my favorites because. They're Megalodon teeth, and this one, uh, I like it, you know, but, uh, whenever it's that, um, this one, I, yeah, it, it always tricks me into thinking that it's, like, broken a bit, like, on this part right here, because, you know, part of this whitish part, um, isn't there, so, but it's not, it's actually... Uh, just as good as this one, except it's a bit, uh, you know, a tiny bit more broken. But, yeah, I actually used to have a great white, I mean, a Megalodon tooth, but it was actually a replica. But, so, these are my first two real great white shark teeth. Uh, so, yeah, that's kind of cool. Uh, and I got this for my 10th birthday. This for my 10th birthday. Uh see here this for my 10th birthday i'm pretty sure Th this for my 10th birthday 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 sorry if i went over that for a few times and this 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 and this are we we didn't buy them or anything we just got, we got them, we found them at, me and my, me and my dad found them at a place called Master Rock, I'm pretty sure I already told you that. But, yeah. And then I got this, oh, no, this one, hold on, there we go. And, yeah, I guess one more look up at all, the front of my back. Gosh. Um, just one more look at all of these. For, again, figure out what this is. Uh, Great White too. Motherfuller tooth, M Megalodon tooth, and Megalodon tooth. Actually, um, p p another name for Megalodon is actually Mega Tooth Strike, named for its, uh, you know, giant tooth. It's like a Mega, mega Tooth. And, um, I'm talking loud again because uh, the air conditioner or something is on at my neighbor's house. And actually, uh, when, when these fossils were actually first discovered, uh, the, the, they thought it. That these were actually dragon tongues. Not sure why they thought that. Um, you know, I'm no dragon expert because they don't exist. Uh, so, um, you could believe that they exist, but I don't. Uh, yeah, I'm making a video. That's my brother there. Um, what's it called? Yeah. This doesn't look like I got a dragon tooth. I guess that's when they believe in dragons. Um,. And, uh, sorry for you doing that. And, uh, what's it called? Yeah, um, that's, I, I can't, I don't really think, I can't really think of anything to say, really. Oh, um, you may, you may notice that this isn't a bag, and all the other things aren't. That's because, you know, this is really delicate, you know dried up uh, species is, you know, to be dealt at, uh, and as you can see in the bag, little bits of it already fallen off, but, yeah, and so on this layer, I keep, uh, what's it called, uh, I'm pretty sure I keep this on here, the, the, uh, this stuff, and this layer, uh, this, uh, these, this ocean stuff on the top layer right there. And then these clam fossils and stuff, I keep, right, on, on the second to last layer. Uh, no, these I keep on the top layer. These I keep on the middle layer. These I keep on the second to last layer, and these I keep on the bottom layer. Finally.
Okay, I got it right. And let me notice that cage over there. Uh, that's actually my little snake cage of that big. It didn't look exactly like that because my, bro my brother gave it to my brother. I mean, I gave it to my brother for his lizard. Alligator. For, yeah, for his alligator lizard. And, uh, what's it called? Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just going to start to put all of these back in the thing. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed that video. And, uh, yeah. Bye.